Something very special indeed to make it to a UEFA Champions League final. Now these two teams intent upon tasting glory. Welcome to the showpiece event on the European club calendar. Derek Ray here on the commentary position, joined tonight for live coverage by the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. It is Bayern Munich facing Milan. Well, it's an absolute pleasure, Derek, to be here. Very, very lucky indeed to be broadcasting to millions and millions of people, let alone watching this fantastic game. I'm sure the players are a little bit nervous as well with that audience looming in the background, tuning in on their televisions. It's going to be a great night. I'm very excited to be here. Hopefully we get the game that this tournament deserves. starting 11 for Bayern and this is a formation most people in the game are very familiar with nowadays yeah most coaches are adopting this formation what it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them but it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker it is the game that the world truly focuses on the Champions League final only two teams left in the quest for European glory Who's it going to be tonight, Lee? Well, it's a toss of a coin for me. It's a really big night for everybody. All that hard work leading up to pre-season training, going through your domestic league, playing Champions League on and off, the winter break, all of that culminates in tonight. Very, very big night for everybody concerned, supporters, but most so the players. They have to stay focused, play the game, not the occasion. And Milan's lineup looks like this. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Alessio Romagnoli plays alongside Simon Kerr in central defence. And the striker is someone who can finish with the best of them, Ante Rebic. Well, if the trend is your friend, every reason to believe that Thomas Müller will make an impact here, Lee. Well, we say to each other in the back four, don't give him a yard because he will score. Don't give... Rebic! Well, as we see, there'll be an inquest between keeper and defenders. He'll be saying, where were you? And they'll be saying, why didn't you catch it? Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Well, he's got to be delighted with his players. A big smile on his face. They've got the noses in front. They're in the lead. Well done. One team crestfallen, the other jubilantly. Well, there's winners and there's always losers. Fine margins between the two. Expectation wins nothing, Derek. You've got to go out there and seize the moment. But for these players, well, it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, you have to enjoy it because it passes so quickly. They know what comes next, the presentation of the cup with the big ears. Well, you just think how many games they played this season as well. All that's in the past now. The game that's just happened was the most important one. They're all poised. The Champions League winners. You can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. And this is really special, getting to celebrate in front of your own fans. Well, it's giving something back. These fans have travelled all over the place. 
following their team. Now they get to join in the celebrations, go into the crowd and give them the cup. That's what I say. Well, then it might never find its way to the trophy cabinet, Lee. along the way in this tournament all comes together at the end when you pick the trophy up just look at them celebrating a brilliant moment hard work indeed lee the trophy now in their possession <laughs> 